going on up here? Looks like a fucking Teletubby. Hi guys, Journey 20 is back, and check out my wicked fucking sunburn. It hurts so bad. Anyhow, I'm here to tell you I had a fucking awesome time at Wizard World on Sunday. I breathed the same air as Tom Edelston. It was glorious. I got a hundred feet from him. That's close as I could get. I guess in the last video, unfortunately, I couldn't get tickets in time because I didn't even know this was going on. I had no fucking idea. But, yeah. So I got within a hundred feet of Tom Hiddleston. Um, but let's just jump right into it. I didn't actually buy as much shit as I thought I was going to buy. I mean, I barely actually bought anything and still spent close to $200. <laughs> like, a hundred bucks. But... Still, um, uh, yeah, like I said, the one celebrity I knew I was gonna meet was Stephen Amal, and we did get to meet him, we got a photo op with him, which is great, oh my god, look at this. Look how adorable this man is. Is he not fucking gorgeous? Look at, so cute, look at that face. Just wanna ruffle his beard, it's so cute, and he smelled so good. Look at that fucking smile. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous, super sweet guy. I look like shit in this photo. Look at that sunburn, look at that. My chubby fucking cheeks, my double chin. Ugh, it's disgusting. But he's awesome. He, I thought my friend was going to pass out. And they straight up tell you, you're not allowed to hug them, no inappropriate touching, no kissing, no nothing. She's like, fuck you, I'm going in for a hug. She's like, can I have a hug? Got her hug. She was really happy. I was happy for her. So we had fun with that. We spent the rest of the day, um, after that we spent the rest of the day roaming around to different booths. After we finally ate something. The line for the photo app actually moved really quickly, which is weird. It moved fucking fast after they got VIP through. General admission got through and it went by really quickly. Um, I mean, people were still waiting. When we got done, people were still waiting for John Cena. And then so we're going to pick up our pictures and all you hear ah! Here comes John fucking Cena. Yeah. I'm not a wrestling fan, sorry. I completely got out of wrestling a long time ago. Um... So, yeah, we visited a whole bunch of, there was a lot of cool booths there. Um, I did grab one t-shirt. We saw these as soon as we walked in. And the one I originally wanted, they did not have my size. Uh, I was originally going to get a t-shirt with a bunny on it. That was wearing Death's Row. It said, hippity hoppity, death is on its way. Whatever. But I got a unicorn that says, I will cut you. Which, I like this shirt. Unicorn is going to fuck your day up. Um, so there's that. And who the fuck actually goes to a comic convention and walks away with bars of soap? <laughs> me. That's who. The lady sold me when she said, I have Mountain Dew fucking soap. I'm like, yes. And to be honest, it actually smells more like green jello and looks like slime or slime. I don't know. Do you see the resemblance? Real Mountain Dew is actually not this color. It's a little more like piss yellow. I told myself I was going to stop drinking that shit. Also, I got Wonder Woman. We can smell like Wonder Woman. I'm not exactly sure what that smells like. Hang on. Coconut oil, sunflower oil, castor oil, palm oil, glycerin, shea butter, water, sodium hydrate, oil, fragrance oil. It doesn't tell you exactly what fragrance oils are in it, but... What the fuck ever. Um... I think the one actual comic book thing I got was a print... A Joker print, which... I'm trying to fill in that one whole wall with Joker posters, so I only got two up there. I need this one. I'm loving it. I have to get a frame for it. Um. So yeah, I am such a nerd. Giant pins. It's Baby Hawkeye. He's so cute. And I got Jareth from the Labyrinth because you know what? You remind me of the babe. And because I got this, I got a free 2016 Comic Con pin. <sighs> I'm such a nerd. What are the pins that I get? Ah, another Hawkeye pin. I don't see why everybody hates Hawkeye. I like Hawkeye. He's not superhero-ish, but he still kick your ass. My my Loki pin. Isn't he cute? It's all chained up and vulnerable. <laughs> and, of course, you know, Chris Hemsworth of flowers. So why the fuck not? Why would you not want Chris Hemsworth wearing fucking flowers? Um... I can't wear these hairbands to save my life, but I got one anyways, because it's covered in Tom Hiddleston. 
Why would you not want that? Oh, he sure looks in that picture. Hi, you boy. Mm. So pretty. Loving him so much. Um, I got three bows. I don't feel like getting up to get the third one. Can't go without your Batman bow. Um, I got my Black Widow hair bow. Uh, sadly though, the fucking clip fell off of it, so I have to fix that. Obviously, I got in there before Christmas one. Um, and I'm really in love with these earrings. So I have my Tom Hiddleston earrings, which are adorable. I have to wear those. And then I have my Joker and Harley earrings. You see? Bogus. Yeah, that's good. I don't know which one's gonna wear tomorrow. And because I felt like spending five bucks on a piece of fucking plastic, I seriously, it's a piece of fucking plastic. That's all it is. It's Rumpelstiltskin because I love Rumpelstiltskin from once upon a time. I'm a Rumbeller. I'm a dearie. I fucking love, I follow anything Rumpelstiltskin on Tumblr. It's ridiculous. I ship Rumbel so hard. Um, that's all I fucking got. I feel really pathetic. That's, I could have spent a lot more money. I got this at the train station. <laughs> I don't know why, but I love this fucking thing. It's so soft, it's memory foam, and it's just... <sighs> you can strangle your enemies with it, too. Huh? I can't believe I just did that. I'm so tired today. I, I'm so fucking exhausted over the last two days. Yeah, that's all I got. Um, I will show you some pictures that I got. This is, like, the closest I would get to Loki in general. So this was a cosplayer. And he was just super cute. I'm like, can I please take a picture with you? He's like, of course. Plus, I look super fucking cute. Rocking those Chuck Taylors? Hell so, yeah. P.S. Worst fucking shoes in the world to wear to some place where you're gonna be walking on concrete all day. Oh, feet were killing me. That went backwards. Hang on, I gotta find the other picture. For a split second, I swear to God, I thought this was fucking Jeremy Renner. I thought Jeremy Renner was there. I'm like, are you walking around as okay? Because you're coming home with me. Nope, this guy just fucking looked... He's, like, the best Hawkeye cosplayer there was. He had, like, Jeremy Renner's resting bitch face down fucking perfect. It was awesome. Um, so, yeah. We had so much fucking fun. And I came within 100 feet of also David Cubney, who was there doing autographs. I saw Mitch Pileggi. Uh, William B. Davis was there. Anthony Mackie was there. Sebastian Stan. Um, Chris Hemsworth. Billy Boyd. Uh, Michael J. Fox was there. Christopher Lloyd was there. It was awesome. It's how late I didn't get to see half of these people. Um, Jason David Frank was there. The original Tommy from Power Rangers. It was so cool. Um, we, me and Brittany each had our fucking meltdowns over our favorite celebrities. And I almost passed out when I saw Tom. When I clearly got a shot of his face. I'm like, oh my god, he's right fucking there. He's right fucking there. I thought I was gonna die. And there's a woman behind me on the phone saying he's right there. I can see him clearly. He's got this black V-neck shirt. He's just He's so beautiful. It's amazing. I'm just like, honey, yes, <laughs> preach it, sister, <laughs> preach it. So yeah, uh, my first time at convention went very well indeed. Uh, my feet were killing me by the time we left, and the fact that I have sunburn, uh, yeah, six thirty, six o'clock in the morning, you're trying to put a bra on or sunburn. Hell no, because I was gonna wear my Deadpool T-shirt. Um. I said, nope, I put a dress on that I know I don't have to wear a bra. <laughs> it's the only dress I have that I can get away without wearing a bra. But I carried a backpack around all day on this, and they're like practically bruised them with their, their like rubbed raw right there. So it sucks ass. But yeah, and if any of you guys happen to be at What's a World and didn't stop and say hi to me, fuck you. No, I'm kidding. Um, that's cool. There's too many celebrities walking around, and Excuse me. It's a soda. And you know what? I'm gonna say it. My nerd boner was strong yesterday. Oh, dude, I'll tell you what. Fucking hard on. If I could get one. It's a nerd boner full and hard, man. Whoa, it was like extraordinary. But yeah. I love that. I have fun. I really wish I would have got more stuff now. Um, I had a shit ton of money with me, too. But food there was fucking ridiculously expensive, and I really wish I had my um, hot glue gun. Anyways, um, that's about it. I just spent ten minutes gushing about how the fact that I did not get to meet actually meet Tom Hiddleston, but I did get to meet Chris Stephen Amal, so it was good. 
Really good. I wish this video was a little more exciting, but it's not. I'm sorry. Um, yeah, so I think that's gonna be for me today. Uh, I've had a very long weekend. I'm fucking exhausted. I don't know what time it is. Oh, it's after nine. Okay. And I have to be up at 6.30 tomorrow to go to work. <sighs> so I'm not looking forward to that. But, yeah. That's it. Alright, guys. Um, train how we... I can't fucking speak. Fucking kill me. Alright, guys. Trinity 20 is done. I'm out. Um, feel free to share your stories with Comic-Con. Don't tell me if you met Tom Hiddleston, because I really don't fucking care. Every time I see a picture of somebody with Tom on Instagram or something, it's just like, fuck you. Just, just fuck you. I can't handle life right now. So, next year, I'm totally planning. Next comic convention, we're going, and I think we're actually going to dress up next time, so. Yes. Alright, guys, Train 20 is out. Uh, later days, um, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> Peace out, yo. Ugh, I can't have just said that. I'm done.